Some of my videos were deleted, secreted, mistreated, so I need this cover for having it shielded, call it preheated. Alright, hello everyone, my name is Yud, welcome to Better Gaming. So you read it right, on this video I'm going to show you how you can change the LCD settings of the display of your Nintendo Switch. Okay, before we start I just want to make clear that my Switch is jailbroken, so you need to have a jailbroken Switch for that, otherwise with this method it isn't possible. So here I'm going to show you quickly what it really does. You can install this app and afterwards you have all the different settings which you can set up here. You can even uh, set up a filter etc. And there are more settings inside the app itself, but here this is just the Tesla overlay. So yeah, as you can see it is right now active. Now if I deactivate it, you will directly see, bam, it normally would look like this, right? So now it looks like this. I think it's a little bit too dark, so I'm going to set this up a little higher here. And then I'm going to apply it, and as you can see, it looks now like this. And if I deactivate it, boom, all right. It's a very cool thing as you can see and you can even set other settings like if you want to play with a nostalgic feeling like um, playing Ma the old school Mario or so on N64 or whatever. I can even set it up like this so it looks like the Game Boy version or the N64 version of Mario. Like you can really have that old school nostalgic feeling and the cool thing about this is that it has an overlay. I love apps with overlays because it is so cool and so easy to grab them. Alright, so let me explain you quickly how to do this. So first things first, you will need to go into the description and then download this zip here, Fizo. Alright guys, once you have it downloaded, you can simply connect your uh, micro SD with your computer or just like me, I'm going to connect it through Hackity. And also I'm going to open up my zip file. Now as you can see here, this is the zip file and here we have the root of my SD and the only thing you need to do is to copy paste. Who thought that? <gasps> okay, no, I'm just joking. And yes, you can see I already got it, but you just need to replace all the files if you need to overwrite something. After you've got this, you can simply eject your Nintendo Switch. It's very easy as you can see. Afterwards, let's uh, just launch Atmosphere once again. Oh man, a friend is ringing. Alright guys, afterwards you just need to go into your album and then once you scroll all the way to the right, you will find here Fizo. So you have here the profile settings of the docked version and of the handheld version. Here you can just uh, activate which profile you want to have right now. And here on currently editing uh, profile, you can set up which profile you want to set up right now. Alright, so here you can just go uh, you can choose your profile which you want to edit. So I will go through the profile too with you Because uh, this is the one which looks like the OLED. We start with colors So we click on it and as you can see uh, I gave the temperature the highest volume So if you want to set up something and you want to see how it looks like you could you can just click here on correction active And as you can see it will always change to your settings and let's go through all the settings and yeah, the cool thing is exactly you can even um, set up like filters, blue filters, etc., which you can activate on day or on night. And this is very cool because you can even set up the time. And I definitely like this a lot. And help is nothing really big here. So yeah, this is definitely a must to have from now on on your Switch because you can make things very, very cool here. And yeah, I hope you liked it. Make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe. I hope I'll see you in the next video. My name is you. Peace.